Bruce here from Counting Down To. I'm just going to show you how to add a countdown clock to your MailChimp email. So if you're watching this, you're probably already familiar with MailChimp. It's um, pretty cool email marketing software. And they have this editor you can use to compose your emails that we're looking at here. Uh, so I'm just going to show you what you'd want to do if you wanted to add a countdown clock to your email. So we're going to go to countingdown2.com. The first thing to do is make sure you're using email countdowns and not website countdowns. So we can switch over to email countdowns. And uh, just to save some time, I'm going to go to an email countdown I created earlier. There we go. And I've customized it a bit using the tools on countingdown2.com. And then if you click add to my email, you'll see this uh, HTML code gets displayed below your email. And I'm just going to copy that code snippet. Um, and then back in my MailChimp email I'm composing. I'm actually going to use this block here called code. I'm going to drag that over into the area where I want my countdown to be displayed. And you'll see as soon as I do this MailChimp is going to display this editor over here and they've put some placeholder HTML code in there. But I'm going to delete that code they've added. And I'm going to paste in the code that I just got from counting down to. And you'll see right away my um, countdown shows up in there. You can see the seconds are counting down. A um, little bonus tip if you don't want it to be center aligned. Uh, we actually, because so many people like them centered, we actually put this into the HTML code by default, but you can simply delete that bit where it says text align center and then it will display on the left, which might look better in some layouts. So now if we click save and close, that's going to dismiss the editor for that code block and now our countdown's just showing up there and we can continue editing our, uh, editing our email as we please. Um, I'm just going to do a send a test email of this just to make sure it's working. So send it to myself and uh, might just take a moment but I'm going to check my email here and it should come through any minute and then we'll just see that it's working. Oh, here we go. Okay, and there it is. That's the email I just received. And you'll see the countdown is embedded in there. Just like that. So that's how you can add countdown clocks in MailChimp.